January 2022. This is the start of the walk of the Grunard River. Behind me is Grunard Bay. I'm standing on the bridge over the river here. On the walk I'm going to do today is about five and a half miles. It's walking, looking over here at the right hand side of the river. There's a track which enables a 4x4 vehicle to get to the very lock. Um, on the left hand side of the bridge there's another pathway, a very narrow pathway, which goes up the back of the hills there and down the far side. Um, when I get to the end I can point out where it actually terminates. So, here you bun it on uh, for this walk. Um, nice sky, the sunrise is just about there. There's a bit of pink in the clouds, which I can see, but you can't. Really nice. Anyway, if you do like, give me a wee like if you won't mind. Just there, give me a like. Um, it does help. It gets better all the time if I get likes. Google Analytics and all that. The track is a bit icy in places and uh, quite slippy. Sunrise, I think we're almost nearly there. You can see the pink clouds with the sunrise in the distance there. Don't know if we'll see the sun actually today, but it's usually about 30 degrees on the horizon, so we might get a chance to see it. There was quite a few herds of deer on the way, but we just run away as soon as they, they can scent you or see you. That plane in front, which you wouldn't have seen, but there was deer running across to the right there. They were gone, disappearing into the undergrowth. Very good at camouflage. As I said earlier, this river is really quite in flood. Um, nice though. Keep going. Hands up. I wouldn't say it's a lot warmer, but I don't need the hairy bonnet and the gloves anymore. A lot of the icy puddles have defrosted, which is quite useful, not slippy anymore. What a lovely view. When I arrived, there was a stag down there, but it's gone. Looking back.
this is the end of the walk it's as far as it goes there's usually a couple of boats lying here for the trout fishing I'm not any good at Gaelic but as I recall this is Loch Silga I'm sure I'll get told off for that but um, I just can't get my head around it <laughs> I'll stop here I'll have a coffee and a biscuit as my breakfast aye good so here at last Loch Silga behind me I'm not quite sure if it's in that picture or not and my coffee which is my breakfast Excuse me, we'll have a wee drink. Ah, not very hot, but it is cold. Um, at the start of the walk, it was very dark. Not quite sunrise, so I'm not quite sure if it turns out yet in the video. Um, but at that bridge, the right hand side was the 4x4 four four track that I've taken. <laughs> which is five and a half miles to this spot in time thereabouts the other side of the river there's a pathway almost like a sheep track sheep pathway I hate the word track and pathway I get mixed up um, but that takes you up to the same point but it goes from the roadway along the side of the river and then disappears up the hills as I recall there's a lock in at the top there and it comes all the way around here and it comes down about here somewhere and it's supposed to stop here there's no sign of it just now but I suspect it's a hardly used track um, the GoPro has done okay I'm not sure if it's standing square or not just now it's supposed to self-level off we'll see what happens move it around a bit there let's move it better um, Mavic 3 I'll wait to see when I get back. I'll check it on the beast on the controller for what the video looks like, but I'm really no better. At the beginning, I didn't use an ND filter because it was far too dark, but then with the sunrise, uh, it was difficult. So I don't know if I can pull out the blacks from those videos. I don't know if I can pull out the blacks from the video. At the beginning but certainly round about that concrete bridge um, there was stupendous sunlight coming from the right hand side at the junction between the two mountains there um, not sure that turns out either but um, I was quite impressed I've used one battery so far and I've got a second one in it just now I'll take a couple more videos just now while I'm here um, but no it's, it's a good walk I was here about a week ago and there were two, two white-tailed eagles I saw on the way back but I haven't seen any today lots of red deer around many red deer but they scoot off before you get near them which is good because they're quite dangerous the weather it was four degrees when I left the car this morning at the bridge um, and it, the weather forecast did say it'll feel colder but as usual when you walk you get hot you get warmed up you take the hairy bunny off the gloves off and then when you stop you get really cold quite quickly there's a very slight breeze it's quite pleasant here just now I've got my gloves off because I've got coffee I can take my hat off but my head cools down too quickly um, but really stunning views anyway I've taken a couple of photographs as well they looked really good on the camera but I'll see what they like when I get back add them to the end of the video uh, but don't forget to give me a wee like and subscribe subscription is free you know it doesn't cost you anything it just means you can dip into someone's um, videos they've done be it whoever it is on YouTube and you can also ring the wee bell at the side if you go off the top bell which is the darker color bell you get um, notifications of all new videos that person puts up whether it's mine or whether it's somebody else's there are some, some good guys out there
first 10 of these photographs were taken using the DJI Mavic 3. Really, really impressed. High quality images, details there. Um, this is why I bought it, to do my photography, aerial photography. You can get areas that you could normally get. Um, what can I say? Magic. The following nine photographs were taken using my Nikon Z7 Mark II camera and lenses. Um, I'm really impressed by this camera. I'm glad I swapped from the D850 to this mirrorless camera. <clears throat> the quality of images is stunning. Not every image turns out the way I want, but most of them do. Lovely. Thanks for watching. <laughs>